somebody welcome back with cooking with Nana today I will teach you how to make um, gel ba hack so it's like a sauce with fish so the main ingredients we have is okay. fish deep fry your fish you can grill it until it's dry and the thing I have you can use any kind of fish you have so this is the one I have is that I got it at Asian market so they already like um, kind of did a butterfly um, on the fish so this is how it looked like in a package there's one big one like this and this is this one have four say so you use this you can deep fry it until it's crispy or you can grill it until it's um, dry and crispy another one Once is my shallot I roast my shallot I use probably like 10 and then my garlic I roast my garlic and then I roast the pepper. It's a pan how spicy you want it. And you can use ginger. You can roast your ginger if you prefer. But this is the main thing that I'm going to use. Is an option. Salt. MSG is um, one half of teaspoon. And this is um, um, one teaspoon sugar. Um, you can add a little bit sugar. If you don't like sugar, you don't have to. Like if you don't want to use fish sauce you don't have to you prefer to use salt it's up to you it's your choice so the thing I will do that I already have my fish I um, fry it and my like this is a hang like this this one is a hang um, I fry it so I am gonna bam. Once it's all moon, all smash and crumbles, then we're gonna mix with all the roasted herb that I um roasted and I will show you the next step. And then this is how it will look like because I already smashed it the, my fish so this is what I'm going to do I'm going to add my pepper in here um, if you like it spicy you can add um, as much pepper you want if you don't like too spicy don't add a lot so we like spicy in my house You can toss it. And the garlic in here. And then for me, I'm gonna add the MSG in here. Okay, it's an option. If you want the MSG, you can. And just say I'm gonna do like a pinch of salt. So not that I'm gonna smash this herb together first. Smash all the herbs and the pepper. It's gonna be like this. Make sure it's all smashed. Then you're going to add your dry fish in it, okay? Just add a little bit first and smash it in. Add a little bit more, okay, well I'm going to add it on. Uh -huh. So, I'm going to mix it. Make sure all the herbs and everything is all combined. Okay. Then you taste it. So if you want to add a little bit salt, you can. If you want to add sugar, if you like a little bit sweetness in your thing, you can. But if you don't like sweet, you don't have to add sweet. So I am going to add a little bit sugar. Just probably a little bit, two pinch of sugar. Make sure you 
mix it well. Okay, then you taste again. Okay, so this is my gel bahang. I smash it, everything, so I taste it. I just add a little um, salt and a little bit of sugar, but I didn't add no fish sauce. So, it, so just taste it first. If you like it salty, you add a little bit more, but if you don't, then if you like the way how it is, then leave it alone. So after all, I did not have to use my fish sauce. So I just add a little bit of um, sugar, MSG, and a little bit of salt, and that's it. Because some of the time, the fish that we um, that is in the package, they season it already. So you know, some sometimes they come out um, with salt and stuff like that. So make sure. So this is how it's gonna be like. Mince up my pen see gel pa hang. So you can put this in the container and leave it in the refrigerator. If you made it a lot, you can leave it in your in the freezer and bring it out and um, leave, um, just leave it out on the kitchen counter or in your refrigerator and eat it. So you don't have to warm it up. So this is can be eaten by cold. So once I done, I put in my plate. You can have it with vegetables. With cucumbers, any vegetable you like, and especially with sticky rice. You use your sticky rice, smash it like this, okay, and eat it. You know, mm, it's good for snacks and stuff. So you can have it with hot jasmine rice, with kao jiao, if you prefer. With kao jiao, you can if you want with sticky rice. But sometimes, this is what I do. You know, I grab my rice, okay. I make like a, like a patty. And have my rice, like this. And my gel in the middle, squeeze it, make a roll. Like this, you know. Sorry, it's a little messy because the rice is sticky. You can have it like this, okay, and eat it. Mmm. You can smell the herbs, the spiciness. So this is how my gel bahe will look like. So gel pa hang koi man si ok ma pen bap si. So this is how my um, gel dry fish sauce is gonna turn out like this. Um, if you like it, go ahead and try it. This is a good for like a road trip, traveling, or take anywhere and eat it or, or picnic and stuff. Ma de ma de ma gin gel pa hang nam gan. And thank you so much for watching Cooking with Nana. And we hope to see you again. And I try to do my best to do more video. Like I said, Kopjai Lalai. Tana Aujuk and my Lakon.